today is a special day for you. What day is it? It's horse riding day for it me. It is horse riding. And it's my second day of horse riding. <laughs> it is. Addie started horseback riding about a month ago, and Maya actually decided she wanted to join too. She started her first class last week. But when I got to the first class, I realized my camera battery was dead, so I couldn't film it. So we're getting ready to film her second lesson. We're just waiting for Addie's lesson to wrap up, and then it's gonna be Maya's turn. I am so excited because it's so much fun. I rode that last time, and I got a picture. <laughs> and Mama printed it. Here comes Daddy. Jason hasn't had a chance to see the girls do horseback riding yet, so he and Colin are gonna come for a little bit to try to catch both girlies. Do you see Addie on a horse? Addie's horse? She's on a horse. Good oh, day. Yay! <laughs> oh, why? Yeah, she's riding, isn't she? Me, yeah. What is that? That's a horseshoe print. This is where a horse sees a horse step right there. And there's another one. And there's a horse footprint. Do you see some more? Look, there's some more there. And look, there's one up here too. Oh, yay. Yeah, there's one right here too. Oh. <laughs> I think he just called Nick a dog. Hey, Nick. The horse that Addie usually rides is named Nick, so Addie was introducing Nick to Colin, and Maya usually rides a horse named Val. It's time for your class, Buggies. Are you ready? Yeah! <laughs> Is this Val? Yeah. Did you have fun today? Oh, I forgot to put right, the helmet ready. I can't believe Maya has control of, what, like a 10,000 pound horse? <laughs> That's a little scary. I guess 10,000 is probably a little heavy, right? Maybe two? How, how heavy are horses? I don't know. 1,000 pounds? Maybe we should ask the viewers. How much do you think a horse weighs? I don't know. I'm guessing under 10,000. <laughs> 10,000 might be a little bit I would stretch. say over under, I would say under 10,000. Right, Addie? Yeah, it's definitely under 10,000. Yeah, 10,000 10, seems hot. <laughs> yeah, My I'm truck like... is only like six or 7,000. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely funny because Maya's horse is actually bigger than Addie's horse. So it looks so funny to see this little tiny girl just walk along with this big giant horse. I've been searching Is it Maya? Why? Where's Maya? Ah. All right, so I did a little research. Oh, did you? <laughs> and a horse general usually weighs around 800 to 2,000 pounds. So not 2,000 So I was close. Pounds. More like an elephant's like 2,000 pounds. <laughs> <An elephant. laughs> I was way off. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> It's cute because the instructor tells them to kick the horse to get them to go, but Maya's so little and her kicks are just so small that a lot of times she'll have to kick the horse several times before I think the horse even feels the kick. So I looked up what animals that weigh approximately 10,000 pounds, Lucy, and we're talking about elephants, hippopotamuses, <laughs> rhinoceros, walrus, giraffe. A giraffe? Wow. Giraffe, saltwater crocodile, and the American bison. So, I would say I'm a little off in my scale. Yes, yeah, so let's not teach our audiences incorrectly. Horses do not weigh. <laughs> Abby, I saw you trotting today on your horse. Yeah. You were going pretty fast. I didn't even go that fast last time, did you? I don't know, I did trot last time. You did? I didn't see you go that fast. So do you think Maya's gonna trot today? Um, I don't know. We'll have to wait and it, find it's out. It's pretty much like 
after their stretches and before the obstacle course. Okay, we'll have to watch and see if she does. I find it interesting that they do stretches when they're doing their horseback riding lesson. Now, you wouldn't think that that's something you need to stretch for, but it's surprisingly, you do get a really good workout apparently. When you go horseback riding, it's good for the core, and I guess stretches are important. the horse she's giggling too I think she likes it they are currently playing red light green light on their horses I remember playing red light green light in school and I loved it but playing it on horses that's pretty cool green light let's see if she goes <laughs> she is and now they're playing Follow the Leader. They're playing like all my favorite childhood recess games, but on horses. Oh, it's Maya's turn to be the leader now. <laughs> Gotta lead the way, Maya. <laughs> I don't think the other horse wants to let Maya's horse do the leading though. <laughs> I keep seeing them do this exercise where they turn around so they're seated back in the saddle and they turn back around so they're seated for forwards in the saddle and I'm just wondering what the purpose of that is if it's like an exercise if it's a practical skill they need for something I'm kind of curious I have to ask the girls and see if they know why they do that good job Maya bug Maya's horse wanted a snack break after they ride the horse they have the responsibility of brushing the horse what would you start with, Maya? Uh, Brown rubbery, she said. Uh, could this be it? Uh, Maya did a good job, didn't she? Yeah. Hi. Hi. Whoa. I had to get a turn brushing too. <laughs> Maya's on to the third brush now, which is a soft brush. There's about four brushes you go through in a particular order. And I think the last one, which is next, is for the mane and the tail. <laughs> uh oh! <laughs> Big sister's helping out. It's got a tangle. The horse has tangles? Yep. Oh, we need detangler spray. <laughs> Next time we'll have to bring our detangling spray from home, Maya. <laughs> you think that would work on a horse? Yeah? Hey girls, so I had a question. When I saw you practicing, Maya, I saw you, you were facing forward in your saddle, then you turn and face backwards, and you yeah. no, face forward no, again. That's called spinning the earth. You, um, what, what is it? Spinning you, the earth? Yeah, you just hold it like this, and you turn over like this, and you turn over like this, and you turn back over. But why do you do that? Do you know? Um, no. Do you do that, Addy? No. You don't do that? Huh. Well, apparently we're not sure why they did that turn in the saddle. So if anyone is a horseback rider and knows that there's a reason they do that, I'd love to know. I'm just curious. Yes, it's time for Val to go home for the night. And then you're going to turn towards me and bring him back to the front, all the way to the front. Say bye to Val. Bye. Is he your favorite? Oh, he's so sweet. Bye. See you next week, Val.